Hey, Brent here, and today in this tutorial, I want to show you how to create a cool ribbon style pencil graphic here in Illustrator. Then we'll copy the final graphic and paste it into Photoshop to give it some final details. So we can uh, delete this and start from scratch. I created a new uh, document at 800 by 600 pixels. And to start, we just grab the rectangle tool or shortcut M, and then we'll just click once. And we're going to do a rectangle at 100 by 75 pixels. I'm just going to move this over into the uh, center of the document, a little over to the left side, since this is going to be the start of the graphic. Now we're going to create the back of the first fold of the ribbon. So to do that, we're just going to copy with Command C, and then we're going to paste it in the back. And to do that, we're just going to do Command B. And since you now have that new uh, copy of that rectangle selected, just hold Shift and we're going to go over 12, which is going to be 120 pixels. Now we're going to grab the direct selection tool and just select the top two points and then we're going to go back to the left 12. So to show the effect I'm just going to go ahead and switch the colors here. So this is going to be the eraser of the pencil uh, and I have the colors written down here FF7BAC. And then for the, the curl on the eraser I'm going to make this kind of a a very dull pink D three a three B seven okay so now we have pretty much the rest of the curls so all we need to do is select both of these copy with command C and then paste in the front with command F and then we're gonna go over 12 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 and then we can repeat this step two more times So here we pretty much have the whole graphic, now we just have to switch the colors for each object. So when selecting I'm going to select the one and then hold shift and select the others. And this is going to be the yellow part of the pencil, so I'm going to pull this up and I'm going to make this F C E E 2 1. And then the curls behind that, holding shift to select them, I'm going to switch that color to a dull yellow, D 3 C F A 5. And then for the graphite of the pencil, I'm going to do 303030. And there you have it. So to give the final touches, you can go ahead and select them all. If you want to, you can group it. So Command G to group. And we're going to copy it. So Command C, go over into Photoshop. And then I'll just simply explain how I kind of did these effects. And here's where you can kind of really play around with it. So I pasted it in here as a vector smart object. And then with my brush tool, I have some preset uh, like grunge brushes, or I guess they're called uh, subtle grunge br brushes. You can search at the Google, find some free packs. And then I will use this to mask out to give the actual graphic the grunge uh, look. Or, you, you know, if you like the flat graphic, you can just go with that. Again, you can just experiment with what you want. Uh, and then I just did a real light cream color background with a subtle pattern, which I believe it's subtlepatterns.com. So you can download all that and um, you can get those preset here in Photoshop under your pattern overlay. So those are really helpful. I use those on a lot of my designs. And then you can see I have another effect on the graphic and that's just the outer glow. Uh, very subtle and I don't think I have the size set to anything. That's just because you can't really see the texture on the yellow here. So with that it kind of helps like pop that out. So as you can see I have something very subtle here with the outer glow with the spread and size to zero. So that is how you can make this cool ribbon style pencil graphic. If you enjoyed the video, I'd appreciate if you thumbs it up. And please leave your suggestions in the comments below with maybe a graphic that you'd like to see how to design. And be sure to subscribe so you never miss my next video. Thanks for watching.